This is a model steam engine I've been working on for about a month now. Uh, it's uh, based on a design by Henry Maudsley, who was uh, an 18th or 19th century, I guess, uh, steam engine designer. I believe he was from England. Um, <clears throat> I don't know that this particular model ever got built into a full size engine or not. <clears throat> I uh, found the original model as a drawing in a book and uh, since then I've seen uh, at least two examples of this model. One a single cylinder like mine and then the uh, other one from Henry's original design was a twin cylinder. <clears throat> it's um, an oscillating engine in that the cylinder back here oscillates back and forth with, as the crankshaft turns. Um, <clears throat> and um, it's, uh, it's, it, it, it has a power pulse on both up and down stroke. It's, uh, it's called a double action, so it's, uh, <clears throat> uh, since it does that. Uh, I just finished getting this thing together to where it'll turn today. And uh, it turns pretty smooth. It's, a, it's just a little bit tight. But there's no um, there's no binding, uh, so that's a good sign. It uh, it means that I've got everything in pretty good alignment, <clears throat> and uh, the tightness is just caused by I have a pretty close fit on the parts, and uh, so that's a good thing. With the when you have an engine with this many articulated parts moving, it's always a bit of a struggle to uh, get it to uh, turn over without binding points and. Uh, you know, once I've run it a while under power, it'll probably, uh, it'll be pretty free running, I'm guessing. Um, but you can kind of see the action of the cylinder there. There's a valve that goes in this hole down here, and it'll be attached with one arm to the base. So as that, as that cylinder swings back and forth, it'll feed air to the top of the cylinder and then to the bottom. I still have quite a bit of work to do on the valving and the... Uh, and you know the remainder of the pa air passages and everything so that I can get it running but at least I've got it to the point where it, it is assembled mechanically and it does turn over and I'm very pleased with the way it uh, with the way it performs thanks for watching <clears throat>